Hello friends, welcome to this video. This is gonna be a different kind of a video. I'm gonna do it all in one take. I'm gonna take you on this little trail I do once in a while. Uh, something I've been trying to shoot and uh, to get new ideas from, uh, especially with things that I've seen a lot, that I've are places I've already been to, you know, trying to get things in, into a different perspective. So here I am at this beach. <laughs> this beach here which is down there is a, is a there's a restaurant and the fishermen and stuff like that so you know I don't, I don't like to shoot restaurants too much and if there's a lot of people around I right away I'm escaping so this trail here is something very interesting sorry about the wind I know there's gonna be wind but look at this view. This is uh, amazing. Uh, there's a little spot up here that you can enjoy the view. And uh, I do come up here, you know, but as I said, it's, uh, it's something I see all the time and not something I, I'm, you know, I've shot it a few times I think getting past the the touristy shot takes effort. You, know, you have to like look and you have to sit there and stare and look and see what can be done. Now, there's a reason this spot was picked to make this here this observation point because it's the obvious point. You know? <laughs> so we're gonna continue on now into the depths of the uh here's the uh this is the trail of natural pools and uh yeah there's people on the trail as you can see some people i hope i don't get mugged i doubt it <laughs> but uh yeah my goal and, and sorry about the camera if it's shaking around but my goal is to get out of the touristy things now here we go this is the trail here the trail starts pretty seriously here and I'm just gonna face the camera this way so you can see hello They laughed that I said hello and not boa tarde. <laughs> I'm in Brazil, by the way. Uh, in case you didn't know. Shooting the island, people, everything I can. All right. Uh, we're going to continue on the trail here. <coughs> I got COVID like a month ago. And I still have the terrible the cough. I can't get rid of the cough. So, uh, <clears throat> yeah. One of my goals lately, since I'm in a place that's so easy to be getting these tourist type shots, these huge panoramas and stuff, I've really been trying to get away from that. I mean, have that in my repertoire, but get away from it as well. Now, here's something kind of interesting I don't know if you guys think it's interesting too but we have these kind of like bamboo things and these lines with the Sun behind it it could be could be kind of interesting so I don't know that's something I've been looking at for a while now still you know trying to find the right composition I know it sounds crazy but anyway here we go oh now look at this opening here the trail continues obviously it's a really nice trail actually 
and I did a shoot a couple of weeks ago with a with a model on this uh, at the end of this trail where we where we're going now. It was really fantastic. Okay, I'm starting to get winded. <laughs> I don't know if you can notice, but it's a uphill now, pretty steep uphill climb. And uh, very beautiful nonetheless, but it is a bit of a workout. Okay, here we go. And the reward is coming. As you can see, we're higher up now. Top of this hill, oh my legs, oh. <laughs> I did a leg workout two days ago at the gym and this, the recovery has been brutal. And this isn't helping the recovery. <laughs> but okay, here we are, <laughs> look at this. Okay, there's an observation point up here. I'm going to take you to. You know, while I'm walking, I'm also, well, you know, this is, this is interesting here. Now, one of the issues I've, I've seen with this shot is that it's not as precise as I was li I would like it it's a little bit diffuse I mean it's not like so leading to something it just leads to nothing so here we go there's some people coming oops Hola. okay so we have uphill and we have downhill towards the water so of course I like to make di things difficult on myself so we're going uphill <laughs> all right the re reward is it's quite nice though so you'll see There's an observation, observation point coming. So, I don't know what the myth about what's harder, sta stairs or a descent or ascent. What's harder to do when you're going up? They say an ascent is harder and not stairs. Like this thing, <laughs> stairs. That looks hard, because they're far apart. Anyway. Look at this. Starting to be real nice. I could have swore there was a... Oh. Hold on to the handrail. Get across here. I could have swore there was a... A nice observation point somewhere. Boy. Okay. Pass this mud part here. How many shops shots have I seen since I started on the trail? You know, technically, what can you shoot? You, know, you can shoot these, these little branches like this. You can shoot leaves isolated leaves find one with a with a different color maybe like this maybe that's a nice shot so there's there's many things to shoot along the way but for the purpose of the video I just want to get going and keep going I mean and follow follow through with the idea here Okay, a little bridge, which I'm sure would make a nice shot as well, somehow. Oh, and guess what? More uphill. <laughs> a lot of graffiti on these uh, signs. 
Oh yeah, here we go. Would that make a nice shot, you guys think? I think so. I think that could be cool. So, here we go up these stairs. Oh boy. Oh boy, the pain. The pain. <laughs> okay. It's gonna be great. Oh. Uh. It, it, uh, if it wasn't for the fact that I did a leg workout two days ago, it wouldn't be so bad. But the day after my workout, I, I woke up and my legs are just on fire. So, uh, <coughs> sorry. It's very peaceful here, which is something I really love the peace and quiet you know the area look the area where I am where my apartment is there's a lot of construction in that area for some reason it seems peaceful but it's not so it's always banging or smashing or some drill or okay here's the observation point I was telling you about now let's just go have a look here before we descend into the Okay, so uh, it says anyway, I can't read Portuguese. Now it's super touristy. Super touristy. Nothing nothing wrong with that. But uh, you know what kind of an image would this make? It, you could take it once or twice, you know, but you don't want to start repeating yourself over and over. Uh, so while it's beautiful you know I'm trying to break away from the obvious things that are so typical in the summertime this is it's winter time now by the way here but in the summer it would be impossible to sit here and, and do this video because it would be swarming with people alright so we're gonna go down here. We're gonna go down to those those rocks over there. That's a little secret location I have for shots, which at uh, sunset it's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, it's a bit steep here. You gotta be careful. <laughs> I feel like a, I feel like an old dude <clears throat> panting. <laughs> oh my god, it's pretty steep here. So, anyway, look at that. <laughs> I did it all standing up. Okay, here's another little observation point which is looking beautiful that looks like a nice shot I attempted to take that shot but it's not what we want uh, oh this is a sign this is something I always say be careful if you decide to go into the sea nature uh, warns always uh, be be aware uh, perigo tome cuidado uh, Mm, yeah, be careful if you decide to go into the sea. Nature always uh, advertises. Oh, well, here it is in English. Be careful if you decide to jump to the sea. But the nature always advice. And that makes no sense. Uh, I guess what they're trying to say is you respect nature, which is a very important point because you, you will get messed up by the sea. It's really powerful. Uh, as all seascape photographers know. So here we go. We are approaching the, the end of the trail. Okay, choice rock or path. Uh, take the rocks here. That's slippery. Big jump here. Okay, not that big. Uh, we are approaching the end of the trail here see what kind of shots 
we can get these nice plants. You know, you can always shoot plants. Oh, there's a guy over there ruining my solitude. <laughs> I'm such a loner that <laughs> I see one person in the way and I go, oh, this place is ruined. Goodbye, I'm never coming back. <laughs> There's a little way to get down there. There's also a way to get down here. Let's go down here because <clears throat> nobody's here. And the sun is shining on this side. Okay. I see something that can be interesting as far as a shot goes. Those three rocks right there. Right there. Well, the thing is how to how to frame them, how to compose them, and not get anything else in the way. I think the I think it's better to wait a little because the sun is too too hard right now, still, and uh, I think it's better to wait for that shot. And I think this is this is stunningly beautiful, you know. And look at that. I'm so tempted to get to take that shot right there. But it's not what we're after today. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> today we're after something interesting. Something different. Not the typical panoramic touristy shot. So can we achieve it? I don't know, I guess what it takes is exploring every single cove. Here's a, here's a rock with somebody throwing a cigarette in there. It's perfect. Let's see what happens if we stand on this rock. What do we see? More rocks. <clears throat> Nothing too... Uh, I mean, it's super beautiful, but not what we're after today. Okay, so let's go here. Dangerous. Some of these rocks have algae on them. It can be very slippery. It's interesting that that plant growing right there. I don't know. Let's keep going. Look at this. Oops dangerous place local peligroso danger of drowning you know you can't mess with the sea I, I was a surfer for for many years and almost drowned several times in massive waves that I shouldn't shouldn't have been on but I was foolhardy and young <laughs> so I know the power of the sea <clears throat> okay so this is pretty much the end of the trail here Okay, I shot my model down there. It was quite beautiful. Look at this coast here. <laughs> I know one day I'm gonna be watching this video and thinking, what, what on earth am I saying? This is so beautiful. You know, what more could you want as a photographer? So, but as we know, we always want more. <laughs> Look at this. All right, so we're gonna go down to the very end and see what's there. I hope it's not slippery, but it's better to take precautions. You little bird. Bird landed right there. That's cool. Better to take precautions. You slip and fall around here, and you're dust, man. It's like nobody's around. And to get help will be very difficult. So, this is the end of the trail. So, so beautiful. Now, where's the shot? Where's the shot? You know, sometimes we forget. <laughs> we forget to look behind us to where we've been, to where we came from. 
looking from a different perspective. And I've gotten several great shots that way. I'm walking, walking, and I turn around, and I say, wow, that's, that's really cool looking that way, you know. So interesting to, to turn around once in a while. Anyway, this is so, so beautiful here. You go out to the very edge. You've got to be careful if these rocks have algae on them. That algae could be an interesting shot. Look at this. Alright. That algae, maybe up close, you know, something I haven't done before. You know, I don't want to be obvious either. So, everything has been done that can be done, probably. Now, the thing is to add your own voice to what's been done. And that takes time, and you have to develop it, and you have to shoot and shoot. And sometimes it's a matter of luck if you get a very different and great shot. But it's better to be in control, obviously, and be able to put your voice on things wherever you want. You know, I don't know if it's more beautiful to shoot this way, just to see the sea. But anyway, here's where I am. So beautiful, you know, so beautiful. That's what I'm up to today. I hope you'll check out some other videos on the channel. I've got plenty of stuff to, to look at. And uh, our little hike today, looking for shots. There's a boat. No. No boat shots, enough. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed this. Many greetings from Florianopolis, Brazil. Peace.